Hi, this is Ronnie, and today's challenge is make your own background. And I'm going to use that picture with my niece and her daughter, um, Thickers and Heidi Swab. And this paper, I got it from paper, it's the paper studio I got from Hobby Lobby this last week, half price. And that Heidi Swap stencil. And using the stencil like that, very quick, make your own background. Don't take much with a little bit of spray. And the spray I'm going to use is says it's red. It's got a real fancy name, but it also says red. But it's more of a pinkish red. And it's a glimmer mist. Um, I can't remember what brand it is. Uh, and I'm also going to use the Gold Lame from Heidi Swap. And sprinkle that on there because I wanted to do my layout in pink and gold. And I wanted to use that new paper. Yeah, it don't take long to do a lay, uh, make your own background when you got a stencil. Look how quick that was. Yeah, I know I sped it up just a little bit, but not too much. I cut the happy out of that uh, uh, piece of cardstock there. And I was going to use it on my layout, but then I couldn't find where I wanted to put it. So it ends up getting set aside. I think I'm going to make a birthday card out of it. I've got, you know a die that says happy birthday and use that happy with the other birthday and make a card I think that'll be cute because no you don't want to throw it away after you cut it out and um, I used the polka dot they had some heart paper but I already had hearts on here and I didn't want to use too many hearts so I used the polka dot I love polka dots anyway and I'm not sure the name of those stickers but they're a red glitter and uh, my title is going to be Shades of Attitude. Of course, you can't have too much attitude when you've got heart-shaped sunglasses on. But unless it's a fun attitude, and they look like they're having fun with those. And um, oh, I'm thinking about what to do because, no, I didn't have a whole lot of plans. You saw what I pulled out and it wasn't much because I wasn't sure what to do. That's a Kelly Perky die with a um, cell phone and then I got some vellum out and so I cut the die out on my big shot and I'm going to put it on the vellum and here I knew this was too wide so I was going to have to roll over the glue so it wouldn't be a hanging off the edges but it works out pretty good and since you can't, I probably could have just cut the vellum out again and just laid that one piece in the center. But uh, I wanted to make sure it was behind the whole thing. I didn't want to have to make sure I centered the vellum and then have to put glue on the vellum. So I just put it behind the whole thing. And fussy cut. And here I'm going to put the cell phone down, but I'll move it down in a minute. It's a little higher than... I need it to be. Of course, I didn't know what I was going to use with it when I was doing that. But those are Maggie Holmes 3D stickers. And uh, I decided to use that bow and make kind of like a triangle since that's kind of what it's doing with the hearts anyway. And I, um, oh, and those <laughs> puffy stickers, cute little puffy stickers. They got all kinds of sunglasses and mustaches and lips too. But I was going to put, my plan was to put it on the cell phone, but once I held it up there, I didn't like that too much. And then I remembered these stickers that I was wanting to use. And so I decided to put cuties on there. And it is kind of, these are kind of sticky. They're not like the thickers were. The thickers were in need of some glue, which I do put some glue on once the video ends underneath each one of those letters because I didn't know what ones was actually going to stick or not. The T's stuck much better than I thought they would, though. But that's it. Very quick layout. Didn't take me long. And um, I made my own background. But we'd love to have you join in on the challenge. And you can just link your video to below or a picture and put the picture on our Facebook page. And uh, we'd love to see, you know, of course we look at almost all those Facebook pages anyway. Any of them we'd like to see it. 
And next week we plan on, I think, I think, I can't swear to it, plan on using cork. But, and you can join in next week using cork on your layout. There's my embellishment cluster. And there is the attitude. And I hope I spelled it right. A-T-T-I-T-U-D. If it's not, let me know. I uh, should have Googled it, probably. But I'm pretty sure that's how it's spelled. If not, it sounds like it's spelled that way. And there's shades of. But I want to thank you all very much for watching. And check out Megan and Jennifer and KK's videos. I will leave the link below. And uh, check out their videos and see what they did for their background. But again, thank you all so much for watching. Bye.